Oh yeah, hey how's it going everybody, it's yours truly though, Trigger Trey here. Today, I'm going to be playing some more of that Metal Gear Solid 1. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Let's do this. Alrighty, you see I got the game loaded up? Let's do this. Okay, I don't got no bullets. Let me equip this. Keep this, yep, I'll take that. Hold me face down ass up. Anything in here? Don't look like it. Nope. Okay, what's in here? Oh yeah, I'll definitely take those. Anything else? Yes, sir. No, I wasn't trying to do that. Okay, can I go in this room right here? Nope. Uh, I think I was the only room. All right, let's go to the elevator. Hello, open up. There we go. Go to the basement too. All righty. Whoop! Almost busted my ass. Okay, I can't go in there. Oh, I can go in there. What's in here? Oh, C4, I'll take that. It's gonna come in handy. Can't go in there. What about here? Nope. What we got in here? Take them SOCOM bullets. How about this? Wait, did that open? Oh, some grenades, sweet. Okay, uh, nope, wrong button. Put that there. I think there's one here. I think there's another one around here somewhere, if I can remember. Right here, I believe. Okay. Whoa! Almost busted my ass. Okay, let's go take a look at this other room. Sun grenade. Ooh, the chaff, nice. Alrighty. What have we unlocked? Let me see if this door works. It probably don't. Nope. Ironically, go into a hole in the wall. Okay, jamming. No, no, put that down. There we go. I don't want to fall any more booby traps. Okay, there's one there, one there. Okay. So, let's place. And place. There we go. What's in this one? Oh, shit. I think there's another one up there. Let me try chaff. Yep, there was. Okay, I got two more C4. Let me get my pistol back. I think there's... Okay, let's go in here. Ah, Revolver Ocelot boss fight. Nice. Am I too late? 
I'm still working on the vape thing. I already quit smoking cigarettes. But while this cutscene plays, I'm gonna go grab a drink. He's alive. You're the arms tech president, Kenneth Baker, right? Don't worry. I'm here to save you. No, no, don't touch it. C4. That's what I told my girl last night after I nutted. Go to the chip. <laughs> right. Touch that wire, and the C4 will blow up along with the old man. So you're the one that the boss keeps talking about. And you? Special Operations Foxhound. Revolver Ocelot. I've been waiting for you, Solid Snake. Now we'll see if the man can live up to the legend. Yeah, let's see. This is the greatest handgun ever made. The Colt single action army. I prefer to go with the 44. Six bullets. More than enough to kill anything that moves. Colt 44. King Cobra. Now I'll show you why they call me. But single action is good. Father. All right, let's do this. Draw! Let me make sure I got my gun equipped. Draw! I understand the bullets. Where yet? I may Where yet? go what I want. Shit! Oh no, I'm gonna need this equip. He's got one bullet. Come on! I'm not gonna play Ring Around the Rosie with your ass all day. He's gotta reload, he's gotta reload, he's gotta reload. I love to reload during a battle. There's nothing like the fun to slam. Where are you going? How the fuck did I miss that? Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Got his ass. I'm gonna need some more bullets at some point. Oh man, I almost detonated the bombs. Woo, woo, woo! Go on. You better hurry up, the old man. Got your ass. He's reloading. Okay. Don't you want to settle this? I do. Oh shit! I forgot the bullets ricochet. Got your ass! Go shit! We gotta take over. Shit! I gotta reload. I don't got no bullets! Shit! Give me that, give me that, give me that! Shit! Got him! Come here. We're gonna play Ring Run Rosie again? I'm out of bullets again. Shit. Homie's on, he busting a nut. Reload, 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 reload. There we go. Come on. I can do this. Come here, bitch. I'm out of bullets again. There we go. I can score something right here. Reload. Damn, he got me in the ass. Got your ass. Come here, come here. Get him, get him. There we go. You're pretty good. Just what I'd expect from the man with the same code as the boss. It's been a long time since I had such a good fight. But I'm just getting warmed up. Is that so? What? Woo! My Cut his hand right off. <laughs> Oh, you didn't like that, did you, bitch? Stealth camouflage. There goes my boy. Cyborg ninja. Right? You were lucky. We'll meet again. Yeah, run away, little punk ass bitch. I like you. I have no name. That that exoskeleton. Yeah, he's definitely busting the nut. 
Hey, disappear and run. Sounds about me. <laughs> Who the hell? You gotta forgive Don't me. Talk. I got some cringy uh, humor. Who are you? I'm not one of them. The DARPA chief told me he gave them his detonation code. What about yours? Oh, I get it. Jim sent you. You're, you're from the Pentagon. Answer my question. What about your code? There's no time. I... talked. What? Now the terrorists have both codes and can launch any time. It's not like I didn't fight. I managed to resist Psycho Mattis's mind probe. He couldn't read you? How'd you do it? Surgical implants in my brain. Surgical implants? Hmm. Kind of like a psychic insulation. Everyone who knows these top secret codes has it. Even the DARPA chief? Of course. But the DARPA chief said Mantis got his code by reading his mind. Are you sure you heard him right? Yeah, I'm sure. In that case, how did they get your code? I never had any training on how to resist torture. <coughs> Looks like he had some fun with you, all right. Oh, he's not human. I tell you, he loved every second of it. What happened to your arm? He broke it. Looks like you're more than even now. His was sliced off. Yeah. Oh, you're a funny man. So the DARPA chief, is he okay? Dead. What? I can't be. No, no, that's not what you promised, Jim. Why are you hitting me, bitch? You shut me up. Oh. Calm down. What's wrong with you? I just told you I was here to save you. Uh, I didn't kill the DARPA chief. He had a heart attack or something. A heart attack? Oh, don't be a fool. Anyway, the terrorists have both codes now. Those boys are totally insane. They wouldn't hesitate to launch. I agree, but what do they really want? Oh, who knows? Maybe they're like us in the arms industry, always looking forward to the next good war. Well, I'm not gonna let these maniacs start a war today. You still have the card keys? Card keys? To override the detonation code. I heard you had them. No, not anymore. What? Who does then? Not the terrorists? No, that woman. Woman? Who? A soldier that was thrown in prison along with me. Oh, that Female bitch. soldier, it must be. She said she had just joined up as a new recruit. No, she was they lying. threw her in prison because she refused to take part in the rebellion. A new recruit? Could that be the colonel's niece? I gave her the key. Looks like she managed to break out of here, though. I hope she's okay. I'm sure she is. She's green, but as tough as they come. But how did you know she escaped? I was in contact with her by Kodak. Until I was tied up here, that is. Kodak? Yes. She stole it from the guard. If she still has it, you should be able to contact her. Hmm, I'm sure nice she to know. still has it. What frequency was she at? Oh, yeah. Uh, let me tell you, it's... Uh-oh. Oh. Sorry, I forgot. Really? Damn. Oh, that's right. It should be on the back of the CD case. Try to contact her. I'll contact her right away. But tell me, if this doesn't work, is there some other way to prevent the missile launch? You need to find Hal Emmerich, one of my employees. That's my boy right there, Hal Emmerich. The team leader of the Metal Gear Rex project. A genius at engineering, but a little bit of an oddball. Yeah, he is kind of odd. can figure out how to stop Metal Gear from launching, it's him. What if he can't come up with anything? You'll have to destroy it. Emmerich knows how to destroy Metal Gear. Where is this Emmerich? Well, he's probably being held somewhere in the nuclear warhead storage building. It's north from here. That's where he worked. I understand, but why Metal Gear? The nuclear age ended with the turn of the millennium. Oh, you're wrong. The threat of nuclear war isn't gone. In fact, it's greater than it's ever been. Is that so? The amount of spent nuclear fuel and plutonium is increasing even today. Listen. Have you ever seen a warehouse full of nuclear material? No. Drums and drums of nuclear waste stacked this high, as far as you can see. Because there's still no real way to dispose of the stuff. So they just close the lid and try to pretend like it'll go away? Uh, essentially, yes. And they're not even doing a good job of storing it. Many of the drums are corroded, with nuclear waste seeping out of them. Unbelievable. Mm. Not only that, but several pounds of muff are reported every year. Muff? 
It stands for material unaccounted for. It proves that there's a large and well-organized black market in nuclear materials. Furthermore, since the end of the Cold War, Russian nuclear engineers in particular are out of work with no way to turn. Hmm. In other words, there's plenty of available nuclear material and scientists for making a bomb. We live in an age when any small country can have a nuclear weapons program. What about the other super? It's crazy how this game predicted the future. China still maintain a significant nuclear presence. Complete nuclear disarmament is an impossibility. To maintain our own policy of deterrence, we need a weapon of overwhelming power. The Metal Gear Project. You mean Metal Gear. Yes. You know our industry suffered quite a blow as a result of the cuts in military budgets due to this so-called peace. I remember hearing a lot about mergers and takeovers among the big weapons makers. Yes. And after my company lost their bid to produce the Air Force's next line of fighter jet, the Metal Gear system was our last ace in the hole. That's why we pushed to have Metal Gear developed as a black project. Black project? Secret projects paid for by the Pentagon's black budget. You can avoid a lot of red tape and get a great lead time on your weapons production. And no one can bother you. Not even those bleeding heart liberals on the military oversight committee. <laughs> liberals. Bribes. I prefer to think of it as good business. Anyway, Metal Gear was going to be formally adopted after the results of this exercise were analyzed. I don't give a don't crap about that. you and your company. Yes, that's about what I'd expect from a grunt like you. Here, th this is what you came for, right? What's that? An optical disc. It's all here. The main hard drive was destroyed by gunfire. This is the only remaining copy of the data. What kind of data? All the data collected from this exercise. Don't play dumb. I know you were sent to get this. I hid it from that sadistic maniac while he was torturing me. Oh, it makes you wonder how he hid it. Exists. Make sure you report this to Jim. To your boss. I'll give you my card too. It'll open up all security level two doors. Can you walk? No. No, you go on without me. They got my password. They don't want anything else from me. I have one more question. Who or what was that ninja thing? It looked like you knew something. That ninja? That was Foxhound's Dark Little Secret. Dark Little Secret? An experimental genome soldier. <coughs> you know him? You should ask Dr. Naomi Hunter from Foxhound. She knows better than I. Naomi. You've got to stop them. If it goes public, my company and I are finished. What? Doesn't Metal Gear use currently existing technology? And here it is. Gear itself does, but... He busts in a nut. What did you do to me? Oh, no. Oh, no, it can't be. Those Pentagon bastards. So, they, they actually went in. Did it? What are you talking about? They, they, they are just using you for. <sighs> that bitch is dead. Codec time. Colonel, are you listening? Now he's dead too. I have no idea. Don't lie to me. I'm sure you don't. It looked like another heart attack, but some kind of poison. Well, there are lots of drugs that can cause a heart attack in large doses. For example, potassium chloride or dioxides. But we won't be able to tell without doing an autopsy. Damn. Snake, I want you and Meryl to work together. Can I trust her? More than you can trust me. Get in contact with her. Snake, there's a lot of electrical interference coming from there. It should be okay if you do burst transmission like us, but normal transmission is probably impossible. Try moving away from that area. Gotcha. Snake, get a hold of yourself. Naomi, what the hell was that ninja thing? A member of Foxhound? No. Are you sure? Yes, we have no one like that in our unit. Is that right? Snake, I'm counting on you. 
the world is. Okay, health increase. Alrighty, this is Doug Trigger Trey here. I'm gonna go ahead and end the video. Thanks for watching. Uh, be sure to thumbs up, comment, share, subscribe, and uh, we'll be seeing you in the future on some more epic gaming videos. Peace. Yeah, yeah, yeah.